Hey guys, this is Mr. A Crazy here, and today is the one year anniversary of Ad Astra. Yep, that's right. On this day in 2019, Ad Astra came out in theaters. Happy one year anniversary. <clears throat> it's been exactly one year since this movie, Ad Astra, starring Brad Pitt, came out in theaters on September 20th, 2019, the same day as Downton Abbey and Rambo Last Blood. So happy one year anniversary to those two other movies as well. But yeah, so Ad Astra starring Brad Pitt. Also it says right here, go behind the scenes with James Gray and Brad Pitt. Also includes deleted scenes and audio commentary. And yes, I, I do remember, I actually saw this movie in theaters. Uh, I actually saw this movie in theaters on the day it came out. when I, I saw it with my dad and Uncle Charles. And for what it is, we, I, we all kind of liked it. I mean... I mean, maybe I'll, maybe my Uncle Charles thought, thought it was okay, but I liked it. Yep. And this is what the Blu-ray looks like. And it's made by 20th Century, 20th Century Fox and Regency Enterprises. One of the year's best films. And yeah. And yeah. Ad Astra is actually one of my favorite movies of 20, 2019 last year. Yeah, because even though even though crit critics kind of liked it, while well, audiences kind of didn't really like it that much, probably because there probably because there's like a bunch of other outer space movies that are out there, like Interstellar, The Martian, and Gravity, and and I and I do remember when I was watching this movie in the theaters, there might be some there there are there are there are some scenes in this movie where it may feel like Star Wars a little bit, where it's like Star Wars but w without without lightsabers, like you know where it feels like Star Wars. And of course, I do remember there was also a scene in this movie where where the where the moon was considered a, a vacation resort, where there was a sign saying "Welcome to the Moon," and and the, and none none of the people in the movie that, that were on that moon moon vacation resort, like none none of the none of the people in, in the movie were wearing spacesuits, because because in reality, because in reality, astronauts wear spacesuits because there's no oxygen in outer space, and there's also no oxygen in space and. Well, like I said, there's no oxygen on the moon and, and, and outer space, but there's also no gravity on, in space either. Because if you jump, you just end up floating in space and you won't be able to get down since there's no gravity. But that's in reality, since I can probably tell Ad Astra is like a science fiction movie too. But I still enjoyed Ad... Excuse me. But but I still enjoyed Ad Astra for what it is. It, it's great for what it is. So, yeah. With that being said... Happy one year anniversary to Ad Astra. And so that's going to be it for this video. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching. And, and this is Mr. A. Crizzy saying goodbye, everybody. And that's about it.